Let's quickly go over this from the conversation class today in Chesham. I'm doing the same class in Watford, so the people benefit from it. Don't shake the camera so much. So, to taunt, to provoke, to annoy somebody, to make them feel bad, these are all synonyms of each other. If something is bizarre, it's peculiar, it's weird, it's quirky, it's strange, it's unusual, unusual, remember. Uh, if something is lavish or extravagant or posh or luxurious or a word from last term, sumptuous. Okay, so that means luxurious. If, if you have contempt towards somebody, you have hatred towards them, you don't like them. Quite a, rough, quite a rough word. If you endorse something, you recommend it. So you'll see this on LinkedIn quite a lot. I endorse you for the following skills. If you have capabilities, look at the word there. There it is. Abilities. It means you have skills. You are able to do something. You can do it. And of course, Helena said capacities as well. You have the capacity to do something. Um, if you are condescending, you are patronising. It's a very negative word. You praise somebody, but you make them feel bad. You make them sh show them how, how low they are and how superior you are. Um, if you are convinced of something, you're sure of it. You're certain. And if you are retarded, you're stupid. You're a cretin. These are words that were initially once used as normal words, but then they started being used as abuse towards somebody, as like a swear word. So they became very negative. And finally, we were just talking about being PC. I don't know if you've ever heard the expression before. If you are PC, you are politically correct. And if you are not PC, you are not politically correct, which means you're saying the wrong thing. And we were talking about, we don't say coloured people, we say black people, white, Asian, Indian. Uh, South American, we don't say coloured or yellow, because these, these are not PC words. And you'll hear this a lot, we don't say disabled anymore, we say special needs. Um, so, thank you. See you next week.